Oh man, tree hugger's back. I have no idea what weird shit he sent me. <laughs> oh, look at this shit. Oh, he even got it in Spanish. What the fuck? I don't even. What the hell is this game? I, hmm, okay, it's it's. I thought I was gonna get like Japanese cum punt again. <laughs> Anyways, Fit Fire commentary number three thirty three. Tree hugger is back with. I have no fucking idea what this shit is. I, honest to God, I have no clue. I, I told people this is what I want. I want to have... What in the fuck is going on? Holy shit. This is like Spider-Woman. Yeah, she's about to get pissed off. I, I don't know what the fuck just happened. Anyway, for, if I contact you with 333 or, or for the current series, I basically told people, go back, find a game that's been released in the past six months or whatever the hell it is, and send that in to me. That's what I wanted for this particular challenge. So once you had a video, game, whatever it was, go back, record it, Send the shit, and then I'll be able to do the hipfire commentary. I wanted to be able to get basically things that were... What the fuck is going on? What is this shit? I have no fucking idea what this goddamn shit is. Is I'm trying to think of what games have been coming out recently. Is, could this be the Evil... No, the Evil Within wasn't, right? No, it can't be with the Evil Within. I don't know. I don't know what the hell this is. But all I know is he shot her in the fucking face and she said, Oh yeah, watch this shit. <laughs> You think you're gonna shoot me in the face, motherfucker? I don't think so. So there's the weak spot, obviously. I don't even know if you fucking hit it right there. And let me guess, there's gonna be little enemies on the floor that you're gonna have to fight as well because this is every typical boss fight that's ever existed. I think I see some enemies on the floor. Uh, if I'm not, look, you see, the, you see those things that like hunched up. Yeah, those cold people, whatever the hell it is. I, I don't, I don't know what the fuck I'm looking at. This, this, this is like some God of War type shit. <laughs> Oh, it's like, I think every fucking game now has to have this giant fucking boss. Okay, so so basically he had to break a rib cage, her rib rib cage, her rib cage in order to shoot her heart. So he's got a sniper rifle and basically he's gonna have to just keep shooting this crazy bitch over and over and over again. Right? I got that right. I just don't know what fucking game. Do you see those things? Those are those? Wait, I can't tell. Those like people? Maybe she zombified the motherfuckers. I don't know. I can't. Oh, she finally got your ass. And, and that's it. You just keep taking a beating? All right. Whatever. <laughs> so anyway, like I said, all I asked for from people was just, just give me a game that came out within the past. Is that your health on the top? I can't tell. All the way in the... There's a red... Oh, no. Your green bar is, is your health. Got it. All right. I saw a red... You see the way at the other side of the green bar, there's like a red bar? I literally thought that was his health. I didn't even pay attention to, to, the, to the green bar in this motherfucker. No, so anyway, if you guys have a game that's come out in the past six months, I even added um, Battleground, so that way people could, could use that game because I know that's so popular right now. What the fuck? And now Tumor's going to explode. Holy shit. I, oh, little fucking spiders. Yeah, this is some sick fucking boss. <laughs> is this the Evil Dead? I have no fucking idea what this shit is. I don't know. Did it, did it release in the past six months? I hope it released in the past six months. I told people to give me something that released in the past six months, so I have no fucking idea what this damn shit is. And, you know, people don't tell me what the game... She's alive again? Oh, the shit is on her back now. I... Okay, so now you gotta... Oh, you gotta wait till she slams, and then she gives you a couple seconds, and then I got you. There we go. You know, these boss fights and shit. <laughs> Can you dodge? Can you roll? I mean, in third-person games, you know, over-the-shoulder games, they usually add a, a dodge mechanic or something. There you go. Shoot, 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 shoot. Fire, motherfucker. What else you got? You got an assault rifle. Yeah, you have a rocket launcher? I'd fire a rocket. Why don't you shoot her goddamn spine? That's what I would do. Just just go over and shoot the fucking spine, because basically she's like a stick right now. There you go. Now you're shooting that shit. And she just stands there and just takes that shit. Okay, that I don't understand. That's just totally fucking on. All right, whatever. So anyway, if you guys have a game that's come out in the past six months, you could go over the website. Now, now that, based on what I'm posting this, Call of Duty's out, Assassin's Creed is out, so obviously those games are going to count towards uh, that particular challenge. So if you... What? Okay, yeah, I ain't fucking with her now. Look at that shit! What the fuck? Okay, that's kind of odd. She putting herself back together like fucking Humpty Dumpty? <laughs> <laughs> fuck this game holy shit I don't know what the fuck I'm watching no it's so like I was saying so now with uh, Call of Duty's out 
Assassin's Creed is out, you know, you have, you have a couple more options. I think Need for Speed is going to be coming out eventually and shit like that. So, so uh, at some point, some new games are going to be coming out where it's like, you know what, fuck, a new game came out. Let me just send this shit in. Fuck all that bullshit. Here come the spiders again in this motherfucker. I like how he put the subtitles in Spanish. So clearly, he did that shit just to, just to fuck with people. <laughs> I didn't know Tree Hugging knows Spanish. That should have been some funny shit. He just did that shit just on fucking purpose, just so that it would mess with everybody. He'd be like, watch this shit. Nobody's gonna know what the fuck I'm saying. Oh, <laughs> uh, fucking son of a bitch. What the fuck? Now shit's coming out of the ground. That's our other hand. Is the ground melting? You're running on water? I don't, I don't know what the hell's going on. I, I thought you were just like next to a house. Maybe that's, oh, that's the house right there. It got, it got blown up or something. She went that ape shit. There's a crossbow. I don't know what the crossbow's gonna do. Her hands all fucked up. I don't know who thought of this shit, man. But they they are some creative motherfuckers to come up with this. You know, I, I think that's the the big thing in games when you have these single player campaigns right now is you gotta have like these interesting boss fights. And you gotta have these grotesque boss fights. Like what what was it? Bloodborne has them. God of War had some grotesque bosses and shit like that. So essentially, people are expecting. Some high quality boss fights now. You, you can't just do like a, a fucking uh, a Destiny boss. <laughs> Destiny just basically big ass robots or some shit like that. But you got you gotta have something unique for single player campaigns and shit like that. And this is obviously quite a unique boss. I'm sure other games have done similar shit like this. Big ass monster, weak points, shoot the weak points, and they're just gonna throw their fucking detached hand at you. Yeah, that that, that ain't some shit like that. I seriously thought that those frozen. Uh, I, I thought there'd be zombies. You know what I mean? Usually games offer like like the extra bosses or extra enemies and shit like that. And I can't tell if like ammo's dropping for you. Is ammo dropping? No, I don't see ammo. You see, usually you add these the these small level mooks, right? Because you add the small level mooks, that way you can actually have ammo fall on the floor. And I guess that's what the spiders are. Maybe is is that ammo right there? Yeah. That no. Wait. Yeah. You had something. So, so, yeah, and so now you step on these little fucking things. Yeah, there you go. Then there's the ammo. See, I knew it. I knew they had to have, like, smaller enemies and shit like that. Because now you have the ammo that allows you to get whatever the hell. So now you did all that shit. Now you got to shoot her in the fucking face. So what? what is that? A rocket launcher? Yeah, a knifer. See how far that goes. <laughs> so, oh, there you go. You finally nailed it with that shit. Took you a while. You had to get the trajectory on that motherfucker. All right, so you blew up. Her, her spine, her stomach, her heart, her face, her arms are both off. What in the fuck else could she fight you with? She gonna help at you? He's like, yeah, I think I did it. I cut off every nasty ass piece of her. What is, what, what is gonna happen? What the fuck? Is her teeth gonna come at you? Uh, oh, now she's just growing new hands. Okay. Yeah, run now. <laughs> He's just standing there watching that shit. You just, you know, sometimes you don't understand the cinematics. Basically, you shoot, her eyeballs are in her hand? What? I don't know what the fuck I'm watching. Yeah, so, so she's some big tree monster zombie fi thing, whatever the hell. I can't tell what the fuck I just watched. So they're, they're just basically giving you a panorama of what this grotesque boss looks like. Fucking face is melting off and shit like that. I don't think she's coming back to life unless her face is gonna turn into its own monster. No, nope. oh yeah, she's gonna melt like a fucking ice cream cone in the summertime. Look at that shit. <laughs> Look at like a big pool of vanilla ice cream. <laughs> oh shit, now that shit is gonna spread. Look, that's her final boss attack. You gotta run from that shit. I ain't standing in that crap. Look, it, look, look, it fucking shines it. Yeah, nope, I ain't standing in that. Don't touch it either. Don't, don't even touch that shit. You get fucking possessed by zombie juice or whatever. Look at this motherfucker. You got cuts on your hand too. Wait, was that like your, your wife or your daughter or some shit? That way you're all sad. I, I don't know what, I ain't walking in that shit. You gonna turn into a goddamn zombie. I seen enough zombie movies, man. I know what the fuck's gonna happen. <laughs> I am not walking in that shit. Hell fucking no, I ain't walking in that shit. I don't give a fuck if you love that person. She's gone now. Oh, yeah, look, there's the wife. So he gonna, he gonna take the wedding ring. He's like, that shit cost me money. Fuck this. <laughs> you saw that shit at the end? He basically said, man, you know how much I spent for that fucking engagement ring? I need that diamond back. Give me that shit back, bitch. <laughs> I want a divorce. 
<laughs> Anyways, as always, rate, comment, subscribe, and all that good shit. And I'll see you guys in the next video.